Traveling West Virginia with award-winning photojournalist Brad Rice. I grew up on a farm and we had horses and cattle, sheep, pigs, goats, you know, the, everything, the, the normal farm life. So I developed a lot of upper body strength like you had mentioned. So the brooms um, were a natural for me, maybe with the plating and the, and the weaving. My husband was a farrier. He is um, passed away now, but he also did blacksmithing and he did fireplace tool sets. He asked me to put a broom on a tool that he had. About the third one he had me make, I said, time out, I need to learn what I'm doing. So I went to do a class for a week long class. And uh, so that was in 2009. So I've been making brooms since then. This is a uh, raw broom corn. It has the stem, which is used to plate onto the broom handle. Um, and the sweet part is made out of the, what is called hurl. And I buy bales of hurl and bales of stems. So I, I wrap it around and then I make a band of like five wraps to very secure it in place. And I always start and stop at the same spot. And then what I wanna do is add another layer to this. The whole thing that keeps the broom on the handle is the tension. So it's really important to keep it as tight as I can. I have sold brooms to every state here in the United States and five foreign countries. I make everything from holy water sprinklers to witches' broomsticks. So I go from one end of the spectrum to the other. This weekend we're gonna have an open studio. It's a drive around tour and the event is the Droop Mountain Studio Tour. Uh, we have four sites and you'll be able to visit uh, different art studios. We encourage everybody to drive our back roads, stop in and visit us and meet and greet. This is a vegetable brush and this is a pot scrubber. They last a long time. They last a, a lot longer than their plastic uh, store-bought brooms. Uh, they're here for the long haul. Everybody loves them. They're beautiful. And it just makes me feel so good that I created these. The genuine good feeling that people get from seeing them and using them uh, is what makes me the happiest. Amazing work, Brad. Where do you think we should go next? Just let us know in the comments section and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification to get the latest traveling West Virginia uploads delivered straight to you.